It was an unexpected, a unexpected twist and turn during the trial of the Austinique Township clerk, 67-year-old Dennis Albert Liskey, charged with criminal sexual conduct in the second degree. Here's more details on that case. It was an interesting day in court today for the criminal sexual case of Dennis Albert Liskey. Trial was delayed for over an hour in day two of the case. Statements finally resumed around 9.30 a.m. where the victim's mother was supposed to take the stand, but things came to a halt when Liskey unexpectedly took a plea agreement and pled no contest to his charge of criminal sexual conduct in the second degree. Do you understand that by pleading no contest is the same as pleading? With that plea, the family agreed to a sentencing cap of 12 months behind bars for Liskey, who also has a case in Midland for related charges. The trial that was supposed to last until Friday led Judge Mack to apologize, thank, and dismiss the jury early. This case has been resolved by a plea agreement, which I've just taken, that no longer requires your services. Uh, and the reason I mentioned the plea is uh, the cases here at where Mr. Black <coughs> is because the craziest stuff happens during the time. And it happened today. It's happened in the last 38 years. It's going to happen next year. Liskey pleaded no contest when more development surfaced overnight, disclosing additional wrong conduct matters. Liskey's victim, his now 13-year-old granddaughter, who was 12 at the time of the incident, testified on Tuesday, revealing that her grandfather assaulted her in his home back in January of this year. Liskey will be sentenced on Monday, October 16th. 